What is going on everyone? Back in Warlords Joiner, when it was being developed, there was a feature that was supposed to be implemented to be one of the better features that ever hit World of Warcraft or was ever implemented. Now we know that's not the case, and we're talking about garrisons, and the reason why I bring up this question is because I don't know if you have, guys have seen the files that there was supposed to be a large potential of other garrisons to choose from. Now there was, you know, like 10 alliance ones and 5 horde ones, obviously there would be an equal amount for each, but there was supposed to be a lot more for each faction. And the reason I bring this up is because it's either Blizzard just didn't want to release all of that and want to flush it out earlier for the expansion to release it earlier, or they actually saw it not to be that great of a feature. But as we saw, we saw it, there were so many cool different things that could have been made of what the garrisons were and what were promised, and we just didn't get that feature. Now it seems like garrisons, you're just in there, and it's kind of like this mini game, and you just sit in your garrison all day because like you don't really need to leave. I mean, there's a couple things you obviously need to leave for, but you can literally just sit in your garrison all day and just do nothing. So why would you want to have a garrison and not let them explore the entire game, you know? So if they were to have all these different types of garrisons, you know, and maybe like let someone invite each other to a garrison and check it out, it would be a lot better. There's a lot of potential for a garrison that they had. And leading into Legion, you know, getting rid of it would just be the... It, it has to happen because people just sit in their garrisons, farm their herbs, do their work orders, go to the mine, you know, do their shipyard missions and their garrison missions and stuff like that. And the followers are just basically useless and no one even needs to do that. I mean, like you can use them to get resources and gold and I don't know, apex crystals. There's, there's a lot of things you can use them for, but you don't even need to leave your garrison. And that makes a feature pointless is when they take away from other content that's in the game. So, could there have been a lot more potential for a garrison? Of course, we see that. There's a lot of other garrisons that could have been made. But even with those, it still could have been useless. You know, you still probably would have been stuck in your garrison. Um, but leading on to another thing, they, they should have altered how a garrison produced um, resources and stuff like that. You know, you can literally just sit in there and do your crafting and do all of your gathering and stuff like that but they should have taken away from it they should have done less of that stuff obviously it's still cool and you know it's great you can make you can make a lot of gold but in legion they have to alter it and they need to make the followers actually help you throughout the world and now it's going to be happening you know you're going to be have these followers um through your through your artifact that will help you throughout the world and that's good that's why you want these followers to help you out and not just do missions you know stuff like that so, could there be more potential? Of course, there was a lot more. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Do you think garrisons hit it or not? Do you like your garrisons? Um, yeah, personally, I don't think they're that great. I kind of was very annoyed with them at the beginning of Warlords. Now, I mean, I just do them to make money. But, yeah, but that's pretty much why um, I was annoyed with them. Let me know what you guys think. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys did, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. And um, I'll see you guys in the next one.